The outgoing Orange Democratic Movement Party leader, Raila Odinga, has called for thorough investigations and subsequent prosecution against police officers responsible for killing and injuring anti-government protesters a few months ago. Odinga, who was speaking during the party's National Executive Council retreat in Mombasa, stated that ODM remains steadfast in pursuit of good governance, accountability and the rule of law as NTV's Kevin Mutai now reports. The wave of deaths and injuries meted on protesters during the widespread Gen Z-driven demonstrations remained a matter of national concern, more so with the government's limited communication on the matter and its equally limited visible steps to justice for the victims. Raylo Dinga, the man who, at the height of the protests, openly rekindled his friendship with President William Ruto, putting the heat under the government's feet. We condemn in the strongest terms possible this use of force against very innocent people and the loss of life. We say that justice must be allowed to take place against the culprits of these heinous acts. Odinga says the Orange Democratic Movement Party abhors the violence against the protesters whom he insists suffered just for demonstrating for their rights. ODM. Odinga, who is accused of riding in the wave and leveraging on the very protesters' ill fate to get a hand in government, insists he is innocent of these accusations and was only being statesmanly. He faced two tough options. Allow our country to continue with this descent into chaos and statelessness or rise above populist considerations and provide leadership for the sake of Kenya's future. In so doing, you put the party at the service of the country. The former Prime Minister was speaking during the ODM's National Executive Council meeting in Mombasa, where he unveiled the new leadership of the ODM party as earlier proposed by the party's relevant internal organs. Kevin Mutai, NTV, in Mombasa.